Hello and welcome to Google Sheets learning series with Syed. In this episode we will learn how to attach two or more strings in Google Sheets. To follow along with me click on the link in the video description to make a copy of this workbook. There are two sheets in this workbook. See it sheet is where I will demonstrate and do it sheet is for you to practice. Let me go to see it sheet. To begin I will select cell D2. In the column D I would like to produce full names using the first name from the column B and the last name from the column C. How do I do it? I have this function called concatenate. I will use that function in cell D2. I will type in equal to and type in the function concatenate. I have that function here in my view. If I hover my mouse on that function, you can see there is a brief description about this function. It says appends strings to one another. So that's a cute little description but makes it more helpful. So I will simply click on that function now. It says it takes in arguments in a form of string 1, string 2 and so on. So in place of string 1, I will simply click on cell B2. What I am trying to indicate Google Sheet is whatever the value is there in B2, pass it here. Then comma. In the second string, I would like to add a space that is a space between my first and last name. To add a space, I will pass that one in double quotations. Double quotation, space, double quotation again, comma. Then in the last name value, I would like to pass C2. Whatever is there in the C2, pass it here. If I close my bracket and press enter on my keyboard, it now produces a full name. At the same time, Google Sheet is also asking me, would you like to fill the rest of the cells in the similar fashion? I can simply press Ctrl Enter on my keyboard or click on this little right symbol to accept this suggestion. I will click on that. Now all my cells are filled with that formula till this point and my full name is produced. There is another way of adding the strings to one another using the ampersand. Let's take a look at it. In the cell E2, I would like to produce emails using the last name. For that, I will simply press equal to and then select my last name that is as the reference cell C2 is passed there. Then insert ampersand. This indicates Google Sheets to add anything after the ampersand to the value that is passed from the cell C2. To add my email ID, I will pass that in the double quotations. At the rate and I will insert mycompany.com and close the ampersand and press enter. It now produces all the email IDs. I can press Ctrl Enter to accept the autofill suggestion and I have all my email IDs produced. I hope you find this video helpful to attach strings in Google Sheets. I request you to go to Do It Sheet and practice now. Practice as much as you can to retain this learning. In the next episode, we will explore more dimensions of Google Sheets. If you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel and click that little bell icon to enable notifications of new videos from my channel. Thank you and have a lovely day. Until next time.